That's what you do! Stay here, stay here. Go, take him, take him, take him. He has a whole team counting on him to deliver. He has the entire city on his shoulders, hoping that he could bring them glory. There's no one in the NBA that doesn't fear him. Here's why the NBA should be afraid of Luka Doncic. To have a better understanding of the elite nature of Luka legend, let's take a brief look at his remarkable beginnings in Europe. The 6'7 Slovenian signed his first professional contract with Spanish side Real Madrid at the age of 13. He played for the under-16 team that year and was named the MVP of Spain Championships. Again, he was 13 years old. Luca continued to dominate, which earned him a spot with the first team. It was there where the teenager raised eyebrows and obliterated the opposition. During his time on Real Madrid's first team, Luka Doncic averaged 16 points, 4.8 rebounds and 4.3 assists over 33 games. At the age of 18, he was named the EuroLeague Final Four MVP and EuroLeague MVP, becoming the youngest player ever to win the award. Again, this is a teenager who's not only showing skill and physical talent, but also poise and mental toughness that cannot be taught. It's a skill that will improve with time, and that's what Dallas Mavericks owner Mark Cuban saw in the young Slovenian. Luka Doncic was selected by the Dallas Mavericks as the third overall pick in the 2018 NBA draft, much to the surprise of NBA experts from all over the United States. European imports have often been greeted with a fair amount of skepticism, and for legitimate reasons. It's rare that a 20-something-year-old rookie from Europe to adjust to the physical and perfectionist nature of the NBA, let alone an 18-year-old from a country that doesn't have many notable basketball pedigree. Slovenia doesn't produce many NBA-level basketball players, but in Luka Doncic the Mavs spotted a youngster they could mold into a diamond-level player. In Luka's rookie season, he silenced the skeptics and doubters by averaging and would go on to be named the Rookie of the Year. His numbers for the rookie season were monstrous. He started in 72 games, averaging 21.2 points per game. Doncic shot the ball quite effectively too. He had a field goal percentage of 50.3% and was 32.7% from the three-point line. For someone who was virtually an unknown quantity by general managers and NBA analysts, those are some extremely impressive numbers. Doncic wasn't scoring because of volume, he was making shots intelligently by being in positions where he knew those shots had a higher success rate. To add to his stellar shooting display, Luka Doncic also averaged 7.8 rebounds and 6.2 assists. At 19, he knew when to shoot, when to pass and where to grab the loose ball of a missed shot. Naturally, such blossoming greatness merits a player comparison. Former and current players were flung by the so-called NBA experts. Some said Luka's game reminded them of the legend Larry Bird for his nerves of steel when shooting from beyond the arc and his vision for finding the open man. Others compared Doncic's style of play to that of James Harden, Houston Rockets version, with his ability to hit the step back three and to be consistent threat from that range. And there were those bold enough to compare him to LeBron James as a tall, small forward who is able to lead and capable of carrying a franchise to moderate success. But the fact is, Luka Doncic is a unique NBA player. Every year, he's proving that more and more with his overall play. His stats for the two seasons following his award-winning rookie season were mesmerizing. He averaged 28.25 points per game and again with consistent and clever shooting. He improved his 2-point shooting percentage by 7% and his 3-point shooting percentage by 0.3%. That might not seem like an eye-opening increase, but that would be missing the point. It's best to view it from a lens that Luka Doncic is improving rather than regressing as a player. Luka has also improved his passing game where he's averaging 2.6 assists more than his rookie season and collecting an increase of 1.2 rebounds. He's elevating his game, which is terrifying opposing players. Luka Doncic is establishing himself as the ultimate triple threat weapon, something that only elite players can achieve once they reach the status of dominance via excellence. In Doncic's case, he can beat you on the dribble, he can dish dimes to wide open players, and he can shoot from an absurd distance. His shooting range, his eye for a pass, and his body and athleticism helps him go by defenders with ease. How are you supposed to defend a guy who can nullify your strategy of sending the double team, 
can outthink you in a one-on-one -on -one situation, and who has the endurance to play the whole game if needed be. Doncic is an athletic specimen that won't stop physically and can't stop mentally. If you try to get in his head the way the Phoenix Suns players try to in their playoff series last season, Luka Doncic will make you wish you had chosen a different sport. He will embarrass you in every possession. Doncic has the rare gift of being physically blessed and mentally strong. He won't let one play dampen his spirit and will do whatever it takes to win. His team, the Dallas Mavericks, were underdogs in their opening playoff series last season against the Jazz because Luka was nursing an injury. But when he came back to full fitness, the Jazz capitulated and lost heavily. To the point where most of the stars and starters on that Utah Jazz team are no longer there. Luka also took it as an insult that the NBA media wasn't giving his team the credit and respect they deserved when they were set to face the top-seeded Phoenix Suns in their best-of-seven series. Again, Luka proved the world wrong by winning the series 4-3. It's a recurring theme in Luka Doncic's life. People doubt his ability, they doubt his talent, his toughness, his passion, his grit, his strength, his athleticism. His whole life he heard the buzzing of critics who didn't know what to make of him. One thing that no one has ever called out Luka Doncic on was his motivation. The critics could never play down his motivation to be the best player in the world. That's what Doncic is striving to achieve today. That's why the whole basketball world should be afraid of Luka Doncic. He wants to be the best. He has the determination and the skill to pull it off. This season, Doncic will be in the running for the NBA League MVP. That's his next personal target. To outplay and outscore the likes of Giannis Antetokounmpo, Nikola Jokic, Joel Embiid and Kevin Durant, the 6'7 Slovenian knows that it would take more work than he has ever done so far to keep improving his numbers and to carry the team back to the playoffs. He's already made it on the radar for most coaches who would like nothing more than to not face Doncic on a regular basis. Now Luka wants to be recognized as one of the greatest players to have played the game and to do that he would like to put the whole NBA and basketball world on notice for being unsure about him, for being ignorant about his potential to be great. He wants to plant fear in the heart of his opponents on his way to collecting the accolades and respect that he thoroughly deserves. It certainly is a possibility, Luka Doncic has all the tools at his disposal and the creativity to remain fresh and unpredictable. When he has the basketball in his hands, people try to compare him to someone, but the truth is we have never seen anyone of his caliber before in the entire history of the sport. He is a one-of-a-kind and naturally gifted individual who will make you pay if you're caught napping, who will embarrass you by breaking your ankles and who will dazzle all watching with his incredible shot-making ability. Doncic is a person who plays with a smile and a friendly character, but that's because he knows how to destroy anyone that comes his way. His popularity is soaring due to his determined nature to be a winner and his tenacity to fight for every hoop. Luka Doncic has the swagger and the clutch game killing ability to make your heart sink. This is why he has his opponents trembling at the thought of coming up against him. They are gravely concerned when he has the ball and even more so when he doesn't have the ball because they know it's going to be a wide open player for an easy bucket. Having skill is one aspect that will help you excel in the NBA. Having the skill and the mindset will enable you to reach that second level. But having the skill, the mindset and the passion to do it on a nightly basis gives you a reputation. One that makes everyone stand up and notice you. One that makes players defend you tougher. One that has coaches preparing detailed game plans on how to stop you. One that drives panic in the minds of anyone that is in front of you. Without a doubt, Luka Doncic is that guy, and teams should definitely be afraid of Luka Doncic. Do you think teams should be afraid of Luka Doncic? Please let us know in the comments below. But before you go and still want to watch some more NBA content like this, please watch the next video that will pop on your screen.